Hey there, everybody. Uh, I wanted to demonstrate some Isotope RX optimization techniques, some ways to quickly fix noises in RX, audition different algorithms, and get rid of those nasty noises. So I'm working on a gun right now, and lo and behold, there are bullet casings, and I don't want them. I want to add my own. So here's the sound. Very prevalent, uh, close mic, clearly. Now I want to get rid of them. So what I have is an action that glues and then opens an external editor, which I have mapped to RX. That's just two actions in Reaper. I have it mapped to a button. When I hit that button in Multigrid, which is an iPad app, different conversation, opens it up in RX. And now when I do my processing, it applies to the glued item, not the original. I don't have to worry about overriding anything. It's a copy, so I can do whatever I want, and that original is still there. So, it's pretty obvious where the noise is. I mean, I'm going to get rid of those, and I'm going to do it as fast as possible. So, I'm going to just make this a little too fast to demonstrate what's possible in a quick amount of time. Normally, you'd want to zoom in, and I sure wish you could adjust the sensitivity of this select tool, but that's a conversation for isotope. So you want to select the noise in the surrounding regions as much as possible. And, and oftentimes it will go off <laughs> sort of wild and select way too much like all that. I don't want that selected. So you can select the lasso, hold alt, and unselect the areas you don't want. And now hold shift and click to sort of select that noisy area and this noisy partial that I didn't get. And maybe some of this that doesn't appear to be noise. Good enough for the demo. So you do your selections, get that as quick as possible. And now you go to the spectral repair, click spectral repair, click compare, 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 and compare. This will apply it and allow you to quickly see which algorithm algorithm is the best. So go into your compare, just hit preview and tap away. Alias and ghosting, same, pretty good, a little clicky, but not bad. Smoothest yet. So I think the parcels and noise and pattern win in this shootout. Then you go and you click view settings and you adjust the parameters, sort of, you can just guess if you want, do a compare. Do a compare. Uh, Multi-resolution, I do recommend in general on all of them. Uh, from what I've read in the manual and from what people say, it's just a better algorithm. I don't know why you wouldn't check multi-resolution. If anyone knows, please let me know. Best yet, widest band, long surrounding length, before waiting, because there's some ring outs on the sounds. Then you just hit process. So now you've got your file and you could do you could do another cleanup pass which is generally the best way to go. So if you wanted to do another cleanup pass, you could you could just sort of select these slightly noisy areas. And this time I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to get rid of it by Going through the tool, hitting compare, hit compare, hit compare, hit compare, and listen. Actually, this, this sounds pretty good, but I want to adjust the strength.
and there we are. So when you're all done, actually, I might just leave it as it was. When you're all done, override original file, control alt S. And what that'll do is save it and it applied to the glued version. So now in RX, you'll have both. And there you have it. Now you have your copy. It's saved in your RX or in your Reaper session. It's been applied, fixed, and it's fast because you're comparing which algorithm is best, then dialing it in. And it seems with every type of sound, I'm not sure which one's gonna win. It seems to be random. Uh, so quickly compare. Hope that helps you all out. If you have further optimizations, I'd love to hear them. Please leave a comment. Take care.